Hi, it's Gene, retired in Mexico. And if you're new to the channel, we ask one question here, which is, do they write them and sing them like they used to? A lot of people, young and old, they think the old music is better, but I'm not so sure. And today we're going to hit up the lemon twigs. And I want to apologize. My ring light, it just crapped out. So hopefully it's just the bulb. But uh, until, yeah, I'm in this uh, smaller town in Mexico. So it'll probably be a few days before I can resolve that. So I know the picture's not quite as good as usual, but it looks like it's close enough for jazz, as they say. So the most popular song on Spotify is Corner of My Eye, and I found this lyric video. Now, no one has suggested this. Not a single person has ever told me, hey, you ought to hit up the, lem the lemon twigs. But I hear so much about them, and I know they're retro. They... Uh, do uh, older styles that they're updating for the 21st century, which is pretty common right now. And uh, a lot of people love the lemon twigs, so I wanted to check them out. I have never heard them. Can you believe that? Can you believe that I have never heard the lemon twigs? Yeah, because I've listened to a lot of music, but just haven't caught these guys. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Hopefully this won't be blocked. They're on uh, 4AD, I believe. They're from... Uh, Long Island, New York, if I said that correctly. I've got a wonderful feeling that's right for being wrong. Lately, the Lord's got me kneeling. It's been hard to
So I, I didn't want to read the lyrics in advance. I wanted to see if there was a lyric video. And I did read, though, that this is the two brothers with a bass player and a drummer that are session players. And, I, you know, I, I'm guessing that this is his natural voice and not a falsetto, but I can't tell. Um, I'd have to hear some more music by them, but it just sounds like he sings in that natural range. But I like this a lot, so it's a throwback to the 60s, I would say. And so, sure, you've got that sort of vintage uh, kind of Bee Gees um, and other bands like that. But the thing that was so cool about it with the acoustic guitar and the percussion being so uh, prominent, the bass was cool, but I really focused on the guitar and the percussion. It had a little bit of a Brazilian flavor, a little bit of samba or something like that. Uh, I'm not an expert in Latin American styles, but the drumming, um, yeah, really cool. You know, a vintage band that did some some uh, really Latin flavored percussion that no one ever talks about is The Doors. Now, these guys aren't anything like The Doors, but the drummer still reminded me of... Uh, of uh, John Densmore a little bit uh, in his uh, touches there on the percussion and the cymbals and the, the drum kit. It was really cool. I like his voice a lot. It's very emotive. Very emotive. And, and yet it's got, it's emotive, but it's got a little touch of sarcasm maybe just a touch it's kind of cool it's kind of cool the way you you feel the song but and and, and then the lyrics all these things about i saw you twice and when i see you out of the corner of my eye really good imagery about you know just sort of getting a a little glance of somebody and uh he's smitten yeah it's really cool yeah, lots of styles. I'm trying to think who else this reminds me of. Um, but yeah, really. I, I, kind of what I expected, kind of not what I expected. Yeah, really awesome. I like those lyrics a lot. Like the singer a lot. Yeah, I liked everything about it. It was great. Corner of my eye. Glad I checked it out. What am I going to rate it? I'm going to rate it an A. I think it's very good. And I don't know what else I can say about it. Bass, drum, guitar, and I guess some keyboards in there, but I didn't really notice them, to tell you the truth. I was so, when you're doing a reaction first for the first time, it's hard to hear everything on a first listen. So, yeah, thanks for joining me on that here on the channel. Um, do hit that like or subscribe button. You can do it right now. It really helps the algorithm. I appreciate it a lot. Let me know what you think of this song. Uh, like I said, it's their most highly streamed song, so that's what I went with. It's not from the new album. It's from the one before in 2023. But, yeah, I'm anxious to hear more by the Lemon Twigs. So if you're interested in a second reaction, give me some suggestions. I appreciate it very much. And as we say here in Bonita, Mexico, buen dia.